Welcome back. Remember I was telling you about a trick, a simple little thing, a little method you can use that your cheesecake doesn't crack. But what we do is you cook the cheesecake. It's an hour and a half cook time. 45 minutes through, halfway through, you go on the oven, rotate it 180 degrees in case there's a hot spot or a cold spot in the oven. And most ovens, there's spots that are hotter than others. So this way you get this thing to cook evenly. Then when it's all done, you put a toothpick in, you pull the toothpick out, it's pretty clean, there's not a lot of, uh, uh, still a lot of the mix, the cookie, the uh, cake mix on the toothpick, comes out dry. What you do is you shut the whole oven off, and then you take a spoon, and you let the oven door stay open. Now this could take an hour, two hours for this to cool down, but what's happening is the cheesecake itself is gradually coming down in temp. It's not going from 350 degrees right down to cold or room, room temp or anything like that. It's gradually dissipating some of its heat. So what that does is th I think that's the key from keeping the cheesecake from cracking. So now when we pull it out, what you have is see the cheesecake now, see the top? There's no cracks. And I think that's the key. Now most cookbooks, I don't know if, I don't know if they tell you that. It's kind of like a, a little secret. I don't know why, but I tell you what, this awesome, awesome array, the smell is just outstanding.